hello guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much again for um dropping by thank you for your all your unending support welcome to our discovery series yes i put this in a discovery series there is not much talk this in the um, youtube and today guys we are reviewing and comparing these to the original this is the asmal kuro it is very straightforward guys very the um the presentation is too modern this is not your typical middle eastern fragrance look at the box guys there is a leather fill to it a block it's just so straightforward name of the house in the bottom name of the fragrance on the side and that's all about it guys a very straightforward <laughs> and there is just a small on the back which is the name of the house and nothing your side is is where you get your butts good on the bottom and on the top it's just your name of the house logo and your bottle is very straightforward guys same name of the house and coro on the left that's it's all guys it's very very modern and this is your cup very plastic guys and that's click to its place though your atomizer is chrome and let's check it guys very good atomizer <clears throat> yes guys this is a clone of dior sauvage i will say this is a hybrid guys of udi farfoam and udi toilet the opening guys is there is this um wet dry earthy like okmos i think that is the combination yeah there is this like okmos you know like um, the Elamai, the Okmos and Jeromium and the uh, Ambroxan that creates like Okmosy it's like to the Vosier plus Lavender guys um, it's not the opening of the Dior Sauvage I guess the the more on the opening is the Dior Sauvage Udi Farfoam not the Udi Toilet but when you when it this dry down by it will go back to the to the classic Dior Sauvage classic Dior Sauvage UD toilet I guess guys this is more on the old of uh, Dior Sauvage Udi Farfoam not the UD toilet because there is really that um you know a very very matured opening like to the Fougere Okmosi Lavendery that elamai geromium you know that for your type of the okmos so the similar of the um the opening i would just say six out of ten um to the udi toilet but to the udi farfoam it's maybe seven out of ten opening similarity but it when it dry downs guys into an, um one or two hours and the rest of it it is really uh the yours of us with the toilet dna that will that's really nice ambroxan pepper and the uh, bergamot citrus bright um dry down of the yours of us with the toilet <clears throat> it's copy guys so i think i would safely say if if the dry down is um nine out of ten um comparison close to the the yours of us the opening is something like um a very fougere type opening like okmos lavender <clears throat> and etc so six out of ten opening and nine out of ten dry down and total guys for the scent i will give this a scent as um, um eight out of 10 general for the closeness of this guys so that's all my own opinion um because i'm not really getting the dior sauvage 
DNA, dot metallic, um, citrus, pepper, ilamai, and ambroxan opening of the Orsovas EDT or the Orsovas UD Farfom. So I give this scent total of 8 out of 10 guys. And performance, it is very beast mode in 1 hour and settle in 2 hours. And the longevity is 6, six to, to 8 hours. I will give an 8 out of 10 again for the performance. A good sillage, yeah, it can fill up the room. Projection, it's good in one and a half hour. And at two hours, there's project, but it's just around your bubble. And the longevity is just pushing it to seven to eight hours. And that is uh, skin sense after six hours to seven hours. The price, guys, is cheaper. This is, I bought this um, um, $60, so very cheap as compared to Dior Sovas. Dior Sovas is 200 something New Zealand dollars. Um, I give this guys a 7 out of 10 general um, as a clone to Dior Sovas. It's just 7 out of 10. Um, I'm not getting the opening of Dior Sauvage. Yes, the dry down is so similar. It's 98% similar dry down to the yours of us Udi toilet the performance guys is not just bees as the Udi toilet because there is not much ambroxan here and there is a touch of fougere in there so it becomes like not youthful it's more on adult the yours of us it's more on it's not Udi farform because Udi farform has a different DNA um and versatility guys it becomes this as an adult so yeah generally i will give this a 7 out of 10 but to be honest i'm not getting the opening so in my opinion this is just a 7 out of 10 it's still a good fragrance a very still price i recommend this guys if they will reformulate the rips dior sobas i rather um, recommend to buy the clone this is Patrick T saying all the time it's not how you look guys no it always how you smell God bless and peace out